I still want him sacked. Be very clear here. I still want him sacked. I still want Hufflepuff sacked. This doesn't change anything. But it's about Tuesday. Better performance. Team performed a lot better. Apart from the latter part of the first half, team looks a little bit much more cohesive. It ain't there yet. It ain't perfect there. But you're seeing what Sterling brings into the, the attack. You're seeing what Felix was able to do combining with other guys as well. Um, and even Enzo looks in, looking a lot better than he did in the Tottenham game. Badia Shili might probably be one of the better performing defenders that Chelsea actually have. So it was a better team performance. Much more improved from the trash against Southampton and the trash against Tottenham. So it is at least a step in the right direction. And it puts these guys in a right frame of mind for a make or break game on Tuesday. But you have to take everything into context. You have to. And this is what I said in the whole preview. Leeds are fighting relegation. Chelsea has spent 700 mil. So you're playing against a team fighting relegation. So as much as you want to be like, wow, yes, you won and so forth. For final squad, you have to rely on a, a, a defender. The attackers are still not saying what's up. So, and yes, you beat Leeds, but you're beating a relegation team 1-0 at the crib. And it was a close game. <laughs> Towards what it was, because Leeds were actually coming... Um, much better in the second half and in the end of the first half trying to say what, what's up. So it's still not there yet. This game doesn't now change my view on, you know what, Hufflepuff I think is the right guy. It doesn't change that, 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 that viewpoint. That viewpoint still remains the same. It still remains 100% the, the, the same. But Havertz has files on parts that could lead him to jail. It, ha it has to be. So yet again, Havertz played 90 minutes. Please tell me what Havertz provides for this team. I want Hufflepuff Quidditch. Hufflepuff Quidditch. What does Havertz provide for this team? How does this guy play 90 minutes? How does the guy play 90 minutes? It makes no freaking sense. It's like, it's, it, I don't understand. So you're going to take off Felix. You're going to take off Sterling. Because Sterling has probably been the most dangerous attacker Chelsea have had in the last two games. You're going to take them off, but keep Havertz? What is it that ha Havertz has something on you, bro? He must have something on you. So where am I with this? Look, it's, it's a win. But as I said again in the preview... Chelsea are still 10th. Chelsea don't move up in the least. This doesn't change their league position. It's still three wins in, what, 17 games? So, yes, you beat Leeds. You beat a, a team that's one of the worst teams in the league because Leeds are fighting relegation. So, it doesn't change any of points. On Hufflepuff, I'm sorry. I'm not going to jump up and down because Chelsea, that's, this jersey is high tier. This jersey ain't 10th. This jersey doesn't celebrate a 1-0 win against Leeds United at Stamford Bridge. It doesn't. So, this is the least you expect. So, now... Cool. It's a win. It's positive. Something positive. These guys now know how to celebrate a victory and so forth. Something we've not seen since, since Palace. So can you now take this on to Tuesday and beat Dortmund? Because Tuesday, that's where it gets real. Because yes, beat Leeds, Dortmund are a whole other ball of wax. They're one of the most informed teams right now. So it's going to be a whole different challenge for Hufflepuff on that Tuesday, man. Hit that subscribe button over there, guys. Hit that subscribe button. And head over there for our live reaction to this shebang, man. Gets real.